Hi there. This is Jason Bittner from the band Overkill. You may also know me from my time in Shadows Fall, perhaps maybe in Flotsam and Jetsam, or amongst the other bands I've played in throughout my career. Uh, touring drummer with Anthrax, Dark Day Sunday, Burning Human, Stigmata, Toxic, Crisis, Dark Day Sunday. The list goes on and on and on and on and on and on. But anyways, I digress. Today we're going to talk about uh, dexterity with your feet and especially three note groupings. Um, one and does, one e ands, one e us. Um, and when to play left foot lead and how to lead with your right foot and your left foot and alternating footings. And we're going to go through uh, some stuff that will hopefully help you to get your feet a little bit more together as far as knowing what to do and when to do it. Um, when you want to play broken rhythms and things like that, when you're not just playing a straight-ahead double bass groove, okay? So the first topic I want to, the first uh, uh, note value I want to deal with is the one and a grouping. One and a two and a three and a four and a. <coughs> Eighths and sixteenths. Let's get a pair of sticks that aren't broken here. Anyways, um, so that's a that is actually a beat that it's if you put it in uh, beat form, it becomes one of the most played uh, heavy metal beats. It's kind of called the gallop beat. One and a two and a three and a four. But when I first heard this beat, I was very confused on how it was played. I didn't know that you could just go like that with your right foot and then fill in the appropriate uh, with your left. I was just trying to go and just play it dun -dun 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 -dun, alternating my feet. So if my hands were going right, left, right, left, right, left, right, da, 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 I tried to do the same thing with my feet. And the first time I tried to play that beat, it was like this. It was like a total train wreck. So I didn't realize that you could make these beats easier on you by just keeping the downbeat going with your right foot. So you have one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and. And then just filling in the uhs with your left. One and uh, two and uh, three and uh, four and uh. So with a right foot lead, You get that. So when you put some hands over the top just to, you know, play time, you get this. I also will note that I do play heel up for mostly everything, aside from extremely fast stuff. Well, fast for me. Heels come down a little bit, um, or if I'm playing like uh, any kind of Afro-Cuban, Latin jazz, any kind of that, that is played heel down. But for the most part, everything is heel up, engaged, and firing from the leg. So once again, this song is very well known in our song, Feel the Fire. 